I'm Coral Kennedy and I've been with Neolife for several years and I've been asked to share a little bit about my youngest son, Dempsey, who is now six and a half. But two years ago at age four and a half, he was diagnosed with leukemia. You want to talk about something that just broke this mama's heart and rocked my family's world. That's it. A diagnosis of leukemia for your child. A child who doesn't have the choice to forego treatment like adults do. Children are bound to endure conventional protocols. Uh, for my son, it's three years, three months. And we were told that we are not allowed to supplement. And I said, okay, I understand that. There is a different restriction. Because I know real life supplements are much more than that. They are whole food and they are clean and pure and powerful. And so when we were told that there were no whole food, whole food restrictions, I lit up because now I had hope of a different kind. So in partnering with conventional medicine, I devised a plan with the Lord's help that my son will do this holistic, the whole food, right, but on a holistic approach to overall wellness through his cancer treatment, through his leukemia treatment. Um, so we decided that we would do um, protein shakes, we would do carotenoids, trayanin, salmon oil, vitamin E, CoQ10, lecithin, he gets the cruciferous plus, flavonoid complex, and I think I, I don't know if I said acidophilus or not. Um, what else is he's Oh, and the aloe vera plus, super important. So when you look at my son, if I were to show you a picture, you would not believe that he's in treatment for cancer. He looks like a perfectly healthy, robust little six and a half year old kid. Full head of hair, vibrant energy, good skin color. He has never been admitted back to the hospital since we left after induction. And that is so contrary to what we see and even what we were told by the medical professionals who said we were gonna come back and we were gonna be admitted for all sorts of things from simple fevers to nausea, vomiting, constipation, diarrhea, loss, weakness, right? None of these things have happened for my son because since the beginning we partnered with conventional medicine and whole food supplementation. We did this together and he is thriving, thriving. Where other kids in the same situation without a Neolife presence, kind of without the whole food, without the holistic elements of that, you know, they just do conventional medicine, they're sick. They are constantly back in the hospital for all those things that were listed. But I was determined to use the breadcrumbs that have been supplied to us in our life and learning from Louis's testimony too about his leukemia journey. There's so much wisdom, so much wisdom in this group, so much power in these products, so much capability for the body to get itself back to rights and a way that these Supplements will give you a solid nutritional foundation, which in effect also helps the medicine work better. So it does a better job. Because I refuse to let this cancer hold my son hostage at all. Any part of him at all. So I encourage you to take the wisdom of the doctors, but don't check your own brain at the door. Do your research as well. If this is your child you're fighting for, fight like the Dickens. Go educate, go read. Reach out to me, reach out to your upline, reach out to the person showing you this video. Get some more information so you can make better decisions. If you choose not to do that, okay, cool on you. But what if there was something else? What if it could be better? What if, what if your adult friend is now struggling with cancer? What if it's you as an adult who has a choice between conventional treatment and the option to not do conventional treatment. Educate yourself. Dive into these products. Learn about them. There is science behind them. The studies are readily available to you. Again, reach out to the person showing you this information, and I'm sure that they can find me if you have more specific questions that they can't answer or you just want to hear it from the horse's mouth. So I thank you for listening to me, and I hope to encourage you and empower you and give you hope in that kind of situation. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Carl. You're God welcome. bless.